Have you noticed all the colors, flowers, and blooms starting to appear here in Polk County? Well, if you haven't, you need to start checking them out. And a great place to do that is going to be at Bach Tower Gardens. And representing Bach Tower is Cassie Jacoby. And she's the Director of Communications from Bach Tower. So tell us a little bit about the gardens. It is a beautiful time to be there. Just like you said, if you've noticed all these gorgeous colors coming out, it's our peak bloom season. Now it's always a great time to come any time of the year, but this time is especially good because it's an explosion of colors. If you've ever been up north to see the leaves change in the fall, well, we've got people coming from all over the world. They make it an annual tradition. Uh, instead of calling them leaf peakers, I call them, uh, you know, the leaf peepers, they call the ones that go up and look up north. I call these people the spring bloom, peak bloom peakers. So they're all coming here to see how the beautiful colors are looking in the gardens, but mostly the camellias, azaleas. We have some saucer magnolias that are so gorgeous. They're huge and they're lavender and the Spanish moss hangs from them. And the important thing is though, come out right now, it changes every day. One plant will, flowers will fall off and another one will spring forward with lots more blooms. So the whole month of March is a good time to come out and see it. And you get to smell the citrus blossoms in the air. It just smells delicious. Well, I was just out at Bach Tower Gardens and there's just so much to do. Can you tell us a little bit about what some residents here can do when they go out to the garden if they've never been before? Well, that's a great time to go. Maybe you want to go take your sweetheart on a date. It's a very romantic spot, and the weather's been so nice. You could bring out a picnic blanket and a picnic and uh, bring your kids out, run and play. There's lots to do. The, the animals are real friendly. The squirrels might run up and try to uh, beg a little uh, crust of bread from you or a peanut, but that's okay, too, because we uh, want everybody to enjoy nature. And the birds are out like crazy. We're on the Great Florida Birding Trail, so bring your binoculars, and you can do some bird watching. And don't forget your camera. It's a photographer's dream come true, really. And I hear you have some great events coming up. Tell us a little bit about the Live at the Gardens concert series. It's a wonderful thing. We're having all year round now. We used to just have a couple of times a year. You could go inside the visitor center and enjoy an indoor concert. We can hold about 150 people that sit in there and you can sit around tables and have, a, have an adult beverage or your beer or wine or you bring your sodas or just drink some water and um, we'll, we'll have the sodas for you available there. And you can enjoy some unusual music. Like we've got one group that's returning. They've been there before. They're called Acoustic Eidolon. And that group has invented uh, two, uh, a guitar with two necks on it. I think we call it a, a, a get-go, a get-jo. The guy has invented it, so we'll have to ask him uh, how he actually pronounces that. And uh, the, it's just a couple of performers, and they'll perform a really nice evening of, of acoustic jazz and um, Celtic, Celtic music and all kinds of different uh, folk musics and things like that. And the other uh, series you have is the Concert Under the Stars. That is a wonderful concert. Every year people come out in May, it'll be May 5th this year, and you can enjoy a picnic outside on the Great Lawn. We can have a oh, couple of thousand people out there easily. Sometimes I think the most we've ever had is about 4,000. So it gets uh, people bring a concert, uh, bring a, uh, a blanket out, and they enjoy a picnic and their families. We even have picnic contests to see who has the contest, uh, the, the picnic that can be the most elaborate or the best spring or that goes with the best theme. Now we're having jazz this year so it's a new genre of music. Usually in the past we've had patriotic and Americana and uh, orchestral music but this year we've got two up-and-coming jazz group. Actually some people say they're some of the greatest jazz talents in the world but they're not the most recognized name groups unless you're say a, a wonderful lover of jazz guitar music then you will recognize Frank Vignola. Apparently he's playing with he's played with Madonna now Madonna's not coming but uh, he has played with greats like Ringo Starr and uh, he's considered one of the greatest guitar guitarists a jazz guitarist in the in the whole world and so he's bringing his group and then we've also got a group called Solos and uh, they are apparently um, they, they play all different kinds of genre genres of jazz but they're kind of known for being American Irish music so I think you'll be hearing some Celtic music and uh, just all kinds of great American jazz. It's also con uh, considered roots music, roots jazz. A lot of people call it roots jazz because it's got a, a whole bunch of different kinds of maybe a little Zydeco, a little Cajun, a little Irish, um, maybe even some Appalachian music, um, just Americana type jazz. So that'll be a really fun night. People have been asking us for jazz for the longest time and now you've asked for it, you're gonna get it. 
All right. Well, do you have any sponsors you'd like to, to thank about for these events? We have been really blessed to have some some wonderful sponsors. Uh, every one of our sponsors is wonderful. We couldn't put on these productions uh, unless we had the support of our community because Bach Tower Gardens is actually a small nonprofit organization. So with a small staff, we really uh, was stretched the limits with the, uh, the, the funding for things like that. So the Ledger Media Group has been in incredibly supportive as far as giving us some print uh, advertising and then coming out and having a tent. And they have some of their sponsor partners that come out and, and help us out. Our public television friends and of course PGTV is one of our greatest supporters um, but uh, WEDU in, in based in Tampa is really the largest public TV station in Florida and they'll actually put on some uh, promos on the air and encourage people to come um, WSF is a public radio station and TV station in Tampa also and they've been incredibly supporter and uh, incredibly supportive with putting um, announcements on the air and maybe even interviews with some of the uh, some of the jazz artists um, we're hoping, crossing our fingers, that one of their great jazz um, air personalities at WSF will actually host the evening. So, we'll, you know, we're always welcome for more sponsors, too. So if anybody would like to be part of our underwriting support, welcome. We'd love to have you on board. Well, it sounds like you guys have a really exciting program going on out there and a lot of events coming up. Are there any other events you would like to mention? We do have a wonderful one. The whole community loves to come out and enjoy Easter sunrise service um, at 6 a.m. Get there early. It's free from 6 to 8. Admission is free. Parking's always free. And so you can enjoy a sunrise service and then a, a delicious buffet breakfast afterwards, too, for an additional cost. But uh, so many events go on throughout the year that um, you can always find out what's going on at Bach Tower Gardens by going to our website. It's bachtowergardens.org. That's B O K. Tower, T O R, T O W E R, gardens.org. Reason I always want to spell out towers because a lot of people say Bach Towers, but there's only one Bach Tower. Only one Bach Tower in the whole wide world, and you can find out all about it, see uh, pictures, see photos. We've even got 360 degree photos, those ones that you can. Uh, kind of see all around everything inside the tower as well. And you can go to our website, check out all that. You can buy tickets on our website. You can find out all the events on our calendar of events. And you can find out about membership because did you know if you're a member, you get to go in free every day of the year. It's like an annual pass and that's the best deal in town. Still free parking. It's only $12 admission. Uh, Three uh, it's three dollars for kids that are five and under, so it's a, it's a really great deal. So find out everything on BachTowerGardens.org. Please like us on Facebook. We're up to thirteen thousand people who like us on Facebook, and social media is really helping us out. So uh, be sure to share it with all your friends too. And I know your visitor information center is just a, such a great, wonderful area to to learn about the tower, learn about its construction. It's a great place, little area for the kids to to kind of see how this place was built place for adults as well to, to learn and just a great place to visit and learn about this tower and this wonderful area here in, in Polk County. And I'd like to thank you again, Cassie Jacoby, the Director of Communications at Bach Tower for coming on the show and sharing about the event. And for everyone at home, make sure you go see the gardens while they're in peak bloom all through March. And if you can't make it even in March, the gardens still look beautiful all year round. Admission is $12 or free for members. And that's 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. The gardens will be open all year round, 365 days. And their address is 1151 Tower Boulevard, Lake Wales. And their phone number is 863-676-1408. Or you can reach them at bachtowergardens.org. And again, their event, Live at the Garden Concert Series, the Acoustic Eidolon, is Sunday, March 18th at 7.30 p.m. This is $25 per person with a 10% discount for members. Reservations are recommended and there's limited seating at this event. And their next event, Concert Under the Stars, is Saturday, May 5th at 6 p.m. This is $25 per person, $10 for children ages 5 to 12, and children under 5 years old are free. Bring your family in a picnic to spend the enchanted moonlit evening on the Great Lawn with acoustic jazz performances by Solas and Frank Vanola Quintet. For more information regarding any events at Bach Tower Gardens, please visit their website at www.bachtowergardens.org or give them a call at 863-676-1408.